YouTube. It's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be jailbreaking iOS 8.1. This will work on iOS 8 as well. So I'm using the iPhone 5 and as you can see here I'm running it through a virtual machine on my Mac called Parallels and using Windows 10 which is a beta version that hasn't been released yet is not due out until 2015 so you can do the same if you want to jailbreak today and you're running the Mac because Pangu is only available for Windows users so we're going to now proceed to downloading okay now we have installed iTunes in the virtual machine we have downloaded Pangu you see right here so I'm going to go ahead and fire up the Pangu tool and see if we can get this jailbreak started. Now we have got it recognizing our device. Now we had to, it's telling us to unlock the device and choose trust. So be sure you do that. So now we're going to go ahead and click start jailbreak and it's saying the jailbreak might lead to data loss. Switch your device to airplane mode before jailbreak, which could significantly increase the rate of the jailbreak. So we want to do that. I'm going to turn jailbreak the airplane mode on. If you have a large amount of data in your device. Now step three is suggesting that you install a clean copy of iOS 8, which I already have. Uh, I originally had iOS 7 on here, so I just have and update it to iOS 8 today. So I have a clean install of iOS 8.1. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit already did. And it's gonna begin the jailbreak process. And this could take a few minutes, but shouldn't take long. If it's taken longer than, you know, five or six minutes or so, uh, something's definitely gone wrong. So you definitely wanna check in, into it and see if there's any kind of pop-ups or anything it's telling you you need to do. But while we're waiting, if you want to come over to iPhoneCaptain.com, we definitely would enjoy having your company. Uh, feel free to leave comments on anything we post over there. Share any kind of tips, tricks, uh, new apps, anything you want to share over there in the comments. Let's go ahead and see if we have Cydia on our device now. As you can see on the screen here now, we have Cydia installed. And I'm going to go ahead and open it for the first time so you can see that it's loading up. Here we are at the first front page and it, it's telling you here that most packages still need to be updated. So like, just like I told you earlier, please read and make sure that they are iOS 8 compatible before trying to update them. You could damage your jailbreak and end up having to restore your device. So guys, hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Please share it before you leave so we can get the word out that the jailbreak for iOS 8 is available. And as always, be sure to check back every day. We do post something here almost every day relating to jailbreak and iOS apps and news. Thanks for watching.